Welcome to Zebra Aurora Vision Studio. In this tutorial, we'll take a quick look at the user interface to help you navigate in the environment and start building your machine vision applications. Before we start, let's talk about the main characteristics of Zebra Aurora Vision Studio environment and what makes it unique and different from other machine vision software products on the market. The environment is fully graphical, which speeds up prototyping your algorithms especially when compared to traditional libraries that require coding from scratch in C++ or c -sharp. It does not require the user to be proficient in any low-level programming language. Instead of lines of code, programs are made of filter blocks with simple connections between them. Last but not least, compared to other environments and libraries, Aurora Vision Studio has a relatively shallow learning curve allowing you to create your first applications from the very beginning. The main window of Zebra Aura Vision Studio can be divided into six different sections. The main menu and toolbar, which is a standard application menu. It contains all major actions and options, as well as a control bar, which provides convenient access to the most common actions. Furthermore, there is an online and offline mode switch, as well as complexity and language controls at the top right corner of the screen. Toolbox, Project Explorer and Workspaces window. The toolbox contains a task-oriented catalog of filters commonly used in many applications. Project Explorer displays a list of modules, macro filters, global parameters and attachments contained within the edited project, whereas the Workspaces tab enables the user to store datasets grouped by the same category or purpose in a simple and convenient way. When creating an user interface, the HMI Controls tab is also displayed within this window. The Properties window. It is used to set parameters of filters and HMI controls in our program. The small window below displays useful hints, descriptions, as well as links to the technical documentation. Program Editor is the area in which we place all filters or tools and make connections between them. To insert a filter, just drag and drop one from the toolbox or double-click on it. Data Previews. These panels display the data computed by filters. If you drag and drop inputs and outputs of various filters, this is where you will see the corresponding data. Extra options, allowing you, for example, to divide the data preview window horizontally or vertically, can be found in the toolbar. The Controls panel. It contains film strip, console, results, and hence controls. Additionally, we can activate the search results control from the view options in the main menu. If you want to learn more, Please take a look at our technical documentation available at Zebra Aurora Vision Developer Portal. You can find links to the sections of the documentation relevant to this tutorial in the video description below. Thank you for watching. For more information on Zebra Aurora Vision software products, visit us at aurora-vision.zebra.com.